So if you've been looking for new homes with no HOA near Charlotte, this video is for you. I've got two priced about 550 and then 600 that are available now. And then there are four lots that you could potentially pick the plan you want and build it out exactly the way you want. So that's what we're here to talk about today. Well, we're in the know, my team of buyer agents. We can also help you list and sell your house in the greater Charlotte area, but we love new construction. And there's a local builder, really a regional builder, called True Homes. Now, they're like a machine. I think of Henry Ford, the automation of it. You know, if they write seven contracts today, they might also have seven closings today. They, they come in, they go out, and I've got a good reputation. A real value builder. You get a lot for your money with, with True Homes. And they do have an on-your-lot division. Now, as with any builder, don't reach out directly to the builder. Get a buyer agent, go in with representation, and uh, there are a lot of reasons to, to do that. Uh, and it starts with a phone call to me. All right, guys, so like for instance, this is the upper 485. You know, 485 goes around Charlotte, kind of like a clock dial, and uh, it's about 60 some miles all the way around. Uh, very convenient, very well done. So here's the top part of it. Then 77 loops right, cuts right through here, goes all the way up north to uh, and go to Mount Airy. You ever been to Mount Airy? That's Mayberry. Yeah, pretty cool. Great for a day trip. So Mooresville is a small town, one of the great small towns in the greater Charlotte area. Uh, the downtown, by the way, of Mooresville, really cool. There were some scenes there from uh, Homeland. If you were ever a Homeland fan, uh, the first three seasons were shot in the Charlotte area. And then I, I'm thinking about a scene there with Brody uh, and his family in downtown Mooresville. Uh, anyway, I digress because I can. Anyway, so here's where this uh, pin is, is what I'm going to show you. Lake Norman, it's really, really North Carolina's, most people say largest man-made lake because, you know, the power companies, Duke, they ran uh, where the Catawba River runs down. They dammed it up. We've got three lakes like that. And then, oh, by the way, then there's the lakes on that side, like Tillery and Baden and so on. And High Rock Lake. I don't know that one, but there we go. Again, the Petey River and the Yadkin River, they're running through it. A river runs through it. Sounds like a good name for a movie. Now, 77 runs up this way. And you've got Lake Norman, Mountain Island Lake, and then Lake Wiley to the south. The reason I'm pointing this particular uh, area out, now that you're just not quite to Mooresville, uh, which is right there. 77, of course, has toll lanes that you can opt for, uh, as that's coming pretty much everywhere. Uh, we 485 on the south side of Charlotte, about ready to get that. But you know, you've got three powerful communities. You've got Huntersville right here, then you've got Cornelius right here, and then you've got Davidson, home of Davidson College. Shout out to Steph Curry. And you see they're all right along uh, Lake Norman, really. Lake Norman's got lots of a shoreline. Then on the west side, you've got Denver and Trilogy Lake Norman, and the land is uh, cheaper on this side and more readily available. So when True Homes unearthed uh, some lots, now here's what's cool about it. Uh, they don't just build on your lot. They've also found some lots for you to build on your lot. They've got four lots uh, that I happen to know about that are priced right about 100000 which is a good price. And then they've got site work uh, finished in. What is site work? Well, this is uh, city water and sewer, so that's good. No septic. But, uh, you know, site work of things like whatever kind of dirt you have to move, uh, putting in a driveway and sidewalks and uh, et cetera, et cetera. Maybe landscaping. So they've got a budget of around fifty grand plus or minus for that. But here's what's cool about those four lots. Pick a plan, baby. And did I say no HOA? That turns on a lot of people. That You don't need somebody telling you what to do or what you can and can't do, right? So no HOA is pretty exciting. So they've got two lots and some of their popular plans are already under construction. Uh, and these are decent sized lots too. Uh, 0.25 to 0.39. That's pretty exciting. A lot of lots in residential development to get the higher density so they can make the most money out of the amount of dirt they have. A lot of builders are squeezing down to 0.21 and 0.18. And uh, so here we have 0.25, quarter of an acre, up to 0.39. I like that. 
And so they have three of their most popular plans. Now, please understand, True Homes is a given commodity in the greater Charlotte area. You know what to expect. Uh, you're going to get, I mean, it's consistent. And so they're big on land and they got an on your lot division, but that's always the rub. You know, if you find a, a really good lot, it might be here today, gone tomorrow. Here, they've, they've got four lots that you could build any of their plans that have a 40 foot wide uh, perimeter, not 45 or 50, but 40 will fit on these lots. And these lots also are like 0.25 to 0.38. So that's great. So they've got all these plans laid out. They've got a design center you can go. It's a great experience, but please connect with us first. Involve your buyer agent from the very, very beginning. No HOA, I love it. All right, so let me tell you about one that they have up here. It's the Riley plan, very popular, uh, 3,100 plus square feet. And uh, what, what a great plan. They got it priced at 599. They've also got a Kipling priced at 549. Uh, on a larger lot, but it's a little bit smaller house by 300 square feet. So those Riley and Kipling plans are two of their uh, time-honored favorites, as is the Wakefield. And that was on a 0.24 acre. And the, the price is yet to be determined. That house is larger, 3,400 plus, but it's going to be probably in the 600. It's going to cost a little bit more. Uh, and But no, did I say no HOA? Is there an echo in here? No HOA. For the right person, that's amazing. And for somebody that, for instance, you know, on this location, you know, the Lowe's, uh, big box store Lowe's, their headquarters is right there, very close to Lowe's National Headquarters. So let's say you, you look, found a job at Lowe's and you want to live nearby and your budget's five fifty, bam, got a house for you on a 0.39 acre lot. Uh, I mean, this is perfect for people that are relocating to work for Lowe's. It's right there, and you'll be close to Lake Norman. So many reasons to love it. Close to downtown Mooresville. By the way, downtown Davidson is ultra cool, especially right across from the uh, college there, uh, restaurants, and just we have some great small towns in the greater Charlotte area. That's all I'm saying. Some great ones. My, I live southeast, and my favorites are cl the closest, and my favorites Monroe, named after our fifth president, and Waxhaw, home of the Waxhaw Indians, and a lot of history there. A president was born near there. Uh, so anyway, so that's exciting. And then if you want to build from dirt, again, for 100 to 150, with the site work, about 150. And you're going to be building probably in that same price point, you know, 550 to 650, depending on what you build. And they got some great ranch plans, too. Here's another thing. Maybe your kid with your grandkids are moving to work at Lowe's or wherever or want to be in the Mooresville area, want to work remotely, want to be near Lake Norman. And so they've moved down. I and mean, there are a lot of expensive houses on this side of the lake. I mean, we can easily help you spend a million, two million, three million dollars. A lot of the NASCAR guys, uh, people live up this way, doctors, lawyers, uh, really nice, big, beautiful homes, Trump uh, National Golf is real close, uh, lots of golf, lots of boats. Burkdale Village is right here, ultra cool. Uh, so Huntersville, Cornelius, Davidson, and right here kind of between Mooresville and Davidson. That, that's kind of like me being between Monroe and Waxhaw. Although those towns, Davidson and Mooresville, might be cooler than Monroe and Waxhaw, but I love, I love where I am. So on, you're on the east side. So if your kid took a job and moving down, they might be in a million dollar, three million dollar. Let's say you want to build a, a really nice ranch plan and you want to be close to your grandkids. Right over here, just southwest of Mooresville, closer to the lake, could be perfect for you. And you can expect to pay plus or minus 600. Uh, pretty exciting. So we can help you guys. Don't go without a buyer's agent. Don't call the builder, this builder, any builder. Connect with me. Let me connect you. If you're coming in, hey, week after next. Uh, next Friday, Friday after next, those are movie references. Um, call me and let me see which of my team is available. There are so many questions that you may not know to ask in the building process and having a great buyer agent that loves new construction and knows, you know, a lot of agents don't want to do it because you got to wait maybe six to 12 months to get paid. We don't care about that. What we care about is helping you get what you want. And uh, that's what we're really good at. So call me 704 704. 
three four five thirty four hundred hit subscribe like share all the stuff that the youngsters do and uh, couple it with a phone call and ask me about on your lot from true homes in the mooresville area and i'll see you in the next video